we tend to listen to many inspirational stories and uh, we have motivational gurus and lecturers world across whenever we come across these uh, motivational speakers and uh, motivational lecturers all of them tend to tell us one thing that is innovate and get rich yes it's a generalized suggestion of course but when you look at the world's young billionaires when you consider billionaires under 30s there are 15 of them in the world today who have the onerous of appropriate surnames that they have inherited as it turns out there is a simpler way to make money it's simple old fashioned and has been around as long as there have been haves and have nots that's an open secret but no wealth guru will talk about it the way to get money is to receive it as an inheritance according to forbes magazine billionaires under the age of 30 there are 15 of them in the world today who have not worked hard to acquire suitable surnames but they inherited and some of such surnames which got added to the forbes world's billionaires in the recent past include the names of firoz who is 27 and jahan mistri 25 who inherited sarah mistri's 4.6 billion dollars shareholding in tata group similarly livia white inherited 1.1 usd billion of wg industries which is a brazilian electrical equipment company that her grandfather founded which made and which gave the source of livia white's 1.1 billion fortune making her the youngest billionaire similarly we anticipate a rise in the number of young billionaires through inheritance over the next 20 to 30 years affluent people aged 70 and above will leave more than 5 trillion dollars for their children so that inheritance is going to get into the hands of several family members and it will increase the number of billionaires throughout the world including india as hard working middle class people we tend to listen to our tech brothers who are early podcasters and their occasional self help books and according to those books there are numerous ways to become independently wealthy they all say to be job creators or simply get stinking rich for that they will tell you to innovate and disrupt the market to hustle and grind and to be both a digital genius and street savvy we break our heads and spend our good times behind the innovation of so called disruption yes so one among 30 million may succeed but rarely the evidence based studies tell us that only 10% of innovation projects are successful in the world 90% of innovation projects end in failure never seeing the light of the day or generating any benefit for anybody this is what the fate of innovation or the so called disruption in today's world but one needs to constantly try that is where the innovation also tends to happen and that's what we have been seeing and we have been adopting those innovations in our daily life too but there is nothing wrong friends with generational wealth through inheritance that is so large that it eliminates the necessity for employment most likely animosity toward the ultra rich stems from jealousy after all envy is the most natural emotion for the great majority of individuals who work long hours to make ends meet and afford even the smallest luxury in their life of course the former and future oligarchs are just lucky as both good fortune and misfortune are the products of fate but just one proposal and request for the finance geniuses and tech brothers preparing their plans to get wealthy soon as an universal formula 
for all. The request is, please spare the working men and women from lectures on how to get wealthy soon as there is no easy formula to get wealthy and we need to learn to live with the real times. Thank you very much.